Houstonians have been debating the future of the Astrodome for years. Some wanted it torn down, others fought for it to be repurposed, the option that ultimately won out. But something everybody agrees on is that the eighth wonder of the world has historical significance for our city, and now that history is being recognized by the state. Andy Sirota is joining us live at the Dome where a historical marker was dedicated today. Andy. Bill, the Astrodome became a symbol not just of Houston or Texas, but also America. It is now a recorded Texas historical landmark, one that means so many things to so many different people. A Texas state historical marker for the Astrodome. Today's dedication ceremony solidifying the dome's place in Texas and American history. It just has a, just a historical importance in my life and I'd like to see it be able to have importance in my children's lives. Once called the eighth wonder of the world, an engineering marvel, the Astrodome opened in 1965 and was home to the Houston Astros, the Oilers and the Rodeo. It later became a gathering spot for all major events in our city before it was condemned and closed to the public in 2009. I look forward to what this building is going to do in the future. In February, Harris County commissioners approved a multi million dollar plan that would repurpose and renovate the dome. The space is expected to be used for conferences and festivals. The forefathers who brought the Astrodome believed in Houston. They wanted something great. Among the many familiar faces who stood at the podium to speak today, a big thanks from Deanie Hoffines, the daughter of Roy Hoffines, who's associated with the dome's creation. This is a proud day for all of us. And the Texas State Historical Landmark is sponsored by our Houston Astros. Reporting live from NRG Park tonight, Andy Sirota, KPRC Channel 2 News.